A croquette is a small breadcrumbed fried food roll containing, usually as main ingredients, mashed potatoes and all ground meat, shellfish, fish, cheese, vegetables, and mixed with bar copyright kimmel or brown sauce, and soaked white bread, egg, onion, spices and herbs, wine, milk, beer, or any of the combination thereof, sometimes with a filling, for example sautéed onions, mushrooms, or boiled eggs. The croquette is usually shaped into a cylinder, disc, or oval shape, and then deep fried. The croquette gained worldwide popularity, both as a delicacy and as a fast food. Mashed potato filled croquettes are often served as a side dish in winter holiday meals, such as Christmas. In fast food cuisine, varieties exist without potatoes, but with cheese, beef, or goulash, often in a filling based on bar copyright Kamal sauce. Asia India A potato filled croquette called a loo tiki is very popular in northern India and is typically served with a stew. They are mostly eaten as snacks at home and are also popularly sold by roadside vendors. In West Bengal, it is called a chop, as in Bangladesh. Sometimes it is called a cutlet, and eaten plain or as a fast food variation that is served inside a hamburger bun. Meat croquettes called kebabs are made with minced mutton. Lightly spiced beef croquettes are a popular snack and appetizer among the Christian communities in Goa and Kerala. Indonesia, the croquette made of potato and minced chicken inside a crepe-like wrapper is one of the more popular snack items in Indonesia, introduced during the Dutch colonial rule. The croquette is made by wrapping a potato in chicken filling inside a crepe-like wrapper, breaded, and fried. Japan, a relative of the croquette, known as karok is a very popular fried food, widely available in supermarkets and butcher shops, as well as from speciality karok shops. Generally patty-shaped, it is mainly made of potatoes with some other ingredients such as vegetables and maybe less than 5% meat. It is often served with tonkatsu sauce. Cylinder-shaped karok are also served, which more closely resemble the French version, where seafood or chicken and white sauce is cooled down to make it harden before the croquette is breaded and deep-fried. When it is served hot, the inside melts. This version is called cream karok to distinguish it from the potato-based variety. It is often served with no sauce or tomato sauce. Unlike its French cousin, croquettes made mainly of meat are not called karok in Japan. They are called menkai katsu, short for minced meat cutlets. South Korea, usually called garok or kurokit, it is a food sold in most bread shops in Korea. The most common type is deep-fried rolls stuffed with japchae ingredients or chicken curry. Also, garok are sometimes filled with kimchi, pork, and bulgogi ingredients. Many Korean stores often advertise the garok as a French product and is usually sold in most European-style bread stores all over Korea. Europe, Belgium a typical Belgian variety is filled with grey shrimp, garnale croquette and croquettes aux crevettes. They are typically garnished with a slice of lemon and deep-fried parsley. Germany, Austria, and Switzerland, plain potato croquettes are served as side dish in restaurants and are also available frozen in supermarkets. They are usually called croquetten. Hungary, croquette is a small cylindrical croquette similar to the Czech variety, potatoes, eggs, flour, and butter, seasoned with nutmeg and salt and deep-fried in oil. This variety can be ordered in most restaurants as a side dish, and also bought frozen. When made with cottage cheese, they are called tara cubed croquette. Italy In Italy, croquette are made mainly with crushed potatoes or vegetables, like aubergines. They originate from Naples and Sicily, and are served as antipasti in the pizzeria all around Italy. Ireland Plain potato croquettes are available frozen or refrigerated in most supermarkets. They are also homemade, usually with the addition of chopped onion. Netherlands The ragu filled dish was regarded as a French cuisine delicacy, first described in a recipe from 1691 by the chef of the French King Louis XIV and using ingredients such as truffles, sweetbreads, and cream cheese. From the 1800s onwards, it became a way to use up leftover stewed meat. After World War II, several suppliers started mass-producing croquettes filled with beef. 
the croquette subsequently became even more popular as a fast food. Meat ragu covered in breadcrumbs which is subsequently deep fried. Its success as a fast food garnered its reputation as a cheap dish of dubious quality, to such an extent that Dutch tongue-in-cheek urban myths relate its allegedly mysterious content to offal and butchering waste. Research in 2008 showed that 350 million croquetten are eaten in the Netherlands every year. An estimated 75% of all Dutch people eat them, resulting in 29 croquetten per person per year on average. The major consumers are between 35 and 49 years old. The success of the croquette led to a whole series of food products resembling the croquette, but with other types of fillings, such as noodles, rice and kidney, and with names like bamable, nasable, and near brugie instead of croquette. Variants of the croquette which specify the kind of meat can also be found, like Rundvleerskrukket and Kulfsvleerskrukket. Also popular in Dutch snack bars is the Sata copyright croquet where the filling consists of a peanut satay sauce and shredded meat in a ragu. A smaller round version of the standard beef or veal croquet, the bitterball, is often served with mustard as a snack in bars and at receptions. Potato croquettes and potato balls can be bought frozen in most food stores. Brugi croquet, a croquette on a bread roll, is sold in restaurants, snack shops, and even by street vendors. The popularity of the croquet in the Netherlands is such that even McDonald's sells their version on a bun as Macroquet. The Dutch version of Little Balls, Bitterballen, is also found in snack bars. Poland, croquettes in Poland are basically made from a thin, rolled pancake stuffed with mushrooms, meat, cabbage, sauerkraut, or combinations of those ingredients, then covered in breadcrumbs, fried in a pan, and usually served with a clear soup like borscht. Portugal, croquets are cylindrical, covered in breadcrumbs, and deep fried. They are usually made with white sauce and beef, sometimes mixed with varying amounts of pork, and frequently with some churria section no, black pepper nor piri piri to add more flavor. Seafood, fish and vegetarian croquets are also eaten in Portugal, but those have other names, Thus the name croquette only refers to the Dutch-style beef croquette. Russia, the widespread THTH three-quarters N THTH micron N TH degree N euro N florin TH plus or minus THTH micron TH one half TH one half TH degree N is made of minced meat, bread, eggs, white onions, salt and spices, shaped as a meat patty and pan-fried. Bread is added in amount up to 25% of meat adding softness to the final product and also making it cheaper to produce. Another popular variation similar to French coatlets de volaille is chicken Kiev, made from bone chicken breast pounded and rolled around cold unsalted butter, then breaded and fried. Spain, traditional croquetas, in Spain are usually made with bar copyright camel, and only in some cases with mashed potatoes. They are typical tapas dishes, especially filled with jama cubed en, chicken or cod. While in the two latter bar copyright camel is usually employed, potatoes are more common in cod croquettes. Unfilled becherimal croquettes are also consumed in parts of Spain. Also, many bars and restaurants may offer novel, less traditional versions of croquettes with more varied fillings and ingredients such as mushrooms, morcilla, cheeses, cuttlefish, etc. United Kingdom Croquettes are available frozen or refrigerated in most supermarkets, typically with potato filling. Aunt Bessie's produce potato croquettes. North America, Mexico, croquettes are usually made of tuna or chicken and potatoes. In southern Mexico, a variety is made with fresh cheese, plantain, and black beans. United States, boardwalk fish cakes and crab cakes, eaten on the east coast of the United States are essentially croquettes. They consist, respectively, of chopped fish or crab meat, mixed in a buttery dough which is then breaded and deep fried. A deviled crab is a particular variety of a blue crab croquette from Tampa, Florida. The crab meat is seasoned with a unique Cuban-style enchilada or sofrito sauce, breaded with stale Cuban bread crumbs, formed into the approximate shape of a prolate spheroid, and fried. It is meant to be eaten with one hand.
It originated in the immigrant community of Ibo City during a cigar workers' strike in the 1920s and is still very popular in the area. Other types of crab and fish croquettes are made throughout the southern U.S., especially in coastal states such as Louisiana where seafood dishes are common staples. These varieties have different seasonings and shapes, with some served inside the scooped-out shell of the crab. A traditional New England northeastern United States preparation uses ham, usually of the maple-cured variety, along with cooked mashed potato for the outer roll. These are dipped in crumbed breading, and so to copyright ed or fried in a small skillet using butter. Typically, these are most common during the Thanksgiving to Christmas holiday season as one of several ways to use up leftover holiday ham. Another croquette dish popular across much of the American South is salmon croquettes. Any canned fish, usually salmon or mackerel, although canned tuna is also used in some recipes, is mashed by hand to break up any fish bones and give the fish meat a smoother consistency, then combined with a binder and various seasonings. Seasonings typically include pepper, salt, chopped onions, garlic, lemon juice, and or paprika. The binder can be any starch such as flour, cornmeal, matzo meal, ground crackers of any type, even white rice or oatmeal, although these latter variations are not as common, and are mostly limited to the northern U.S. chopped eggs, parsley, and parmesan cheese may also be added. The mixture is then shaped into rounded patties for pan or deep frying. Corn or peanut oil are the most commonly used frying oils in the southern U.S., but canola, safla, or olive oil are also used, and some recipes call specifically for pan frying in butter or margarine. South America, Brazil, croquettes, primarily made from beef, are common in many parts of Brazil. See also Calfrito, Frita List of deep fried foods, list of potato dishes, risol, chicken cordon bleu, references. External links, 4, the official James Beard Foundation blog, Eat This Word, Croquettes.